In this HoopTech how-to, we will show you how to use the HoopTech Gen 2 cap frame. We've talked to a lot of embroiderers, and they all say the same thing. I hate hooping hats. We wanted to make it easier. That's why we came up with the Gen 2 cap frame. In order to use the Gen 2, you will need the T-bar framing gauge mounted onto your hooping station. All of these items used in this video will be linked in the description box below. This cap frame works with all major industrial embroidery machines. To begin, grab a piece of backing. We use this pre-cut backing that measures 3.75 by 11 inches. Slide it under the backing clips and poke it through the tabs to keep it from shifting. Now that the backing is secure, we can frame up the cap. This is an unstructured cap. Pull the sweatband out and slide it onto the frame. Push it all the way forward and the tabs we poked the backing through will help keep it in place. Bring both hands down to grab the T-bar and gently tuck it inside the cap. Using your right hand, apply some pressure to stretch the material down nice and tight. While still applying pressure with your right hand, use your left hand to close the frame. To make this easy on your hands, push down here with your thumb and close it with the rest of your hand. If you are framing up a structured cap, the process is the same. Depending on your cap, you may need to slide this plate in and out to adjust. Place your backing under the clips, poke it through the tabs, and pull out your sweatband. Once you slide the cap onto the frame, place the T-bar in it and pull down gently on the handle with your right hand. Closing the frame with your left hand, make sure these slide into place, and then you are ready to close. Now that your cap is framed up, you can lift it off the framing gauge and walk over to your machine. Make sure you have it centered on the cap driver and click it into place. Now you're ready to sew. This cap frame can do a variety of caps, including visors, some bucket caps, structured, unstructured, flat bills, and more. This frame has a lot of versatility. If you want to learn more, check out our other videos. Thanks for watching this HoopTech how-to. Follow us on Facebook and Instagram for more.